tell me what happened before the fight between the Rockets and Lakers. So, well, I mean, it depends on, honestly, how far back we want to go. We could do a whole show talking about Rajon Rondo and Chris Paul. And, and, you know, the more you pull the onion, the layers back on the onion on that relationship, the more you get reminded that these are two guys who just have not liked each other for a long time. Uh, you know, you have stuff with Team USA, I believe in 2008, where Chris Paul was getting a, a spot on the team that Rondo thought he deserved. You have fisticuffs in 2009, or at least, you know, tension in a New Orleans-Boston game where after the game came to an end, you know, they got into it a little bit. And so you have two guys who have chirped at each other for a long time, and you hear things about how essentially Rondo would get under Chris's skin by, uh, by, by going down the road of, like, I have a championship, the type of thing you want and you're never going to get. And he would get in his head in that way. And then Chris would say, you know, I mean, listen, he's the far superior point guard and, and would kind of have an air about him of, you know, I'm, I'm the king of the point guard mountain, so to speak. So these guys didn't like each other. And, you know, that day uh, in the game, if I had to highlight one play more than any other, it was the one in the first half where Chris chucks Rondo as he's driving from the right side. Rondo goes flying. And, uh, you know, it was a strong play on Chris's part. And after he, you know, Rondo doesn't get the whistle, Chris gets the bucket. Chris flexes twice to the mm. crowd and kind of plays that up a little bit. And from what I heard, Rondo from that point on would not stop talking to Chris. And, and, and it, you know, the sparks kind of started flying at that point. Do you think Rondo spit on him? I, I do. I mean, listen, it's technology is an incredible thing. And <laughs> yesterday when I get the video of that situation, uh, you know, we had seen a ton of video on Twitter and social media already, obviously. But, you know, when you have a 200 megabyte video that, that we got our hands on at The Athletic and I'm looking at a high res laptop screen where you can just sit there and, and watch Rondo appear to kind of check his, his, you know, his left side real quick to almost as if he was, you know, seeing if official Jason Phillips was within, you know, kind of eye shot if he was going to see him. And then you see, you know, spittle, spit, whatever you want to call it, come out of Rondo's mouth and, and go towards Chris. I mean, at minimum, if, if you put yourself in Chris's shoes, it's that idea that you know that Rondo's spit just landed on you. You can't judge intent. But at that point, Chris doesn't care. You just spit on me. And, and that's always going to be a trigger. For more Dan Patrick Show, tune to Audience Channel 239 on DirecTV or download the Dan Patrick Show app.